dreamland now. Shut the fuck up with that squeaking. Be quick when she does that fucking move. Hey, I'm coming. Hey, out of my way, broom. Alright, let me fight. Oh, dear. Yellow Panther. That's new. Ah, you're too slow, girl. Yes. Go aim for the bitch. Oh, the broom is still. Okay, never mind. What? What the hell was that? The wicked witch. Heard of her, haven't you? Now, where did you put that key? Listen, I... How do you come by a weapon? It's Prince Charming's. He no longer needs it. Here it is. <coughs> Thank you. She'd have begged me for certain if you'd not... Siana? Is that you? It's been years, Jack. H have you come to play? No, I just play want your over. Hands, so you can breathe easy. Beans? What beans? <clears throat> Try not to interrupt. Mm. Jack, where are they? Jack the Sienna, bean. I, I, I'm sorry, but, but I haven't got them. Oh, something tells me you're lying. Perhaps you wish to play the old games after all, hmm? This little picky went to market. This little picky went home. 
for instance? I'm telling the truth. I swear it. Anarieta, she ordered them buried all over so you wouldn't be able to leave. Where? I... I don't know. But, but Joss, the boy with the thing for wolves, he should know. He sticks his nose in everyone's affairs. He had better know. Because if not, I'll find you and we'll have ourselves a little talk. Understand? Now shoot. Ah, all right. So why is it you're here? They're looking for you. Came to free you. Nice of you, but a waste of your effort. I plan to free myself. You might, you might not. Bound to be easier with my help, as our most recent adventure amply showed. Mm-hmm. Yet I still don't know why you even give a damn. It's Dedlov. He's trying to force Anna Henrietta's hand. Wants her to release you. Summoned monsters to attack Beauclair. Sounds like Detloff, all right. But I doubt you came all this way just to bring me up to speed on current events. So get to the point, please. Isn't it obvious? Offering to be your ally. We both want you out of here. You because you want your freedom back. Me because as soon as you meet with Detloff, he'll put an end to the chaos in the city. You exposed me. I landed in prison because of you. Now you come to beg my help, I dare say. My life is full of surprises, isn't it? But normally I'd tell you to sod off. But, from what you say, folk are dying who have nothing to do with this. Not part of the plan. Detloff was only to kill those who deserved it. No one else. Fine, Witcher. I accept your offer. Consider us allies. Mm -hmm. Shake on it. Sure. Since you brought it up, the knights Detloff killed. What exactly did they do to you? Crespi, Duak, Lacroix, Peyrek Perrin? Not a memory I enjoy revisiting, but I suppose you deserve to know. When my parents disowned me, they ordered those very knights to escort me beyond the duchy's borders. Mm -hmm. All did so without uttering a single word in my defense. Like you said, they had their orders. Mm -hmm. But Crespi was not ordered to beat me unconscious with a horsewhip after my first attempt at escape. And you like had no instructions to deny me food and abuse me. I learned something then. Knights are not so chivalrous when no one's watching. Sure. That explains a lot. Shocked, aren't you? You must have thought you had me pegged. Before bothering to hear my side. Everyone does that. So, what's with the beans? Mind explaining? Hmm, certainly. That you must gird yourself with patience. Okay. There are two ways out of this land. My darling sister blocked one when she tossed me in here. The other's up there, in the clouds. She made it hard, but not impossible to access by concealing the beans. Still don't understand. Don't fret, just listen. That boy, that was Jack, of beanstalk fame. You know the tale? Mm -hmm. Jack climbed a gigantic beanstalk to a giant's castle, high up in the clouds. As we shall do if we can just find those blasted beans. There are three. One red, one blue, one yellow. Huh. Stalk won't sprout from just one? No, because it must transpire exactly as it did in the tale. Clear now? So we must find Joss. Perhaps he will be able to help us. You lead. Okay. I'm leading in a place I don't... I've never been before. Joss can usually be found wandering the glade at the foot of the mount. Ooh, I'm gonna it's loot some, some bitch. From here, past the witch's house to the right. So, what exactly is happening in the city? People are dying. Massacre, which is why we gotta hurry. Time flows differently in the fatal sphere. We can stay here a week, and outside, mere minutes will have passed. I don't even know why I'm fighting. Oh, shadows. I was playing Adam Wake, so I'm uh, used to this. Not the 
friendliest pixies I've met. And in two seconds, some good lighting. I mean, not what you expect in a Witcher oh, game. Unicorns. We must catch them. We won't have to walk everywhere then. Roach. I call the pink one. Exciting, isn't it? Reminds me of my childhood. Reminds sure. me of something altogether different. Care to elaborate? Rather not. Oh yeah, unicorns in the end. Which we don't know, because I didn't do. Because I'm loyal to my girl Triss. Well, except sometimes with Shiny. And maybe this lady. Is this the boy who cried wolf? Ignore him. He always lies. Aha. Uh -huh. Boy who cried wolf. Still does, I suppose. And doesn't. When they actually appear. The one and only. Listen, you little chit. <laughs> Jack said you know what's going on. Oh, I thought you said little beans. shit. I don't know anything. Not one thing. And besides, watch out. Wolves. Get the fuck out of here. This will be interesting. Right, let's get to it. Let's say for a minute you know what happened to the red bee. Where wouldn't it be? More certain no one swallowed it. Oh no, definitely not that. Of course not. But say someone didn't. Who would it be that didn't swallow it? A human. The most human human in the land of a thousand fables. Everyone! Wolves! Run! Okay, I you a little bitch. <laughs> Bet you haven't heard what happened to the blue bean. Maybe? Not at all? Right? I've heard it lies about somewhere, out in the open. Just like that? No one guarding it? Nobody! Three times over! Help! Wolves! I ain't coming the next time wolves are uh, around. Right. Deep, so deep, in fact, it's completely underground. And who has it? Hmm? A bold the wolves. Hand, who, in no way, are not at all await someone, not in the slightest. Good folk, wolf. Say that word one more time, and I'll chop you up, feed you to the fishes. Understood? Oh shit, wolf! You're dead. All right, we should go. Watch out for wolves! Shut the fuck up. I want to kill that kid. <laughs> Tough to talk to, that one. Was it, though? You need merely remember he always lies. Or more precisely, refers us the truth. Mm hmm. Where to now? I'm not sure. We should visit some of the other fables. The meaty ones, that is. Perhaps then Joss's hints will make more sense. It's just a few. Red Riding Hood, piglets and bears. These are all the fairy and tale dogs, of course. people uh, here. Yeah. Then long locks and a little lass who sells flint. Ah, fine. Let's get to work. You must have loved this place. I did at first, but children get bored quickly. Even tea parties with a whole cackle of princesses eventually turn dull and routine. What did you do then? Dropped a duck egg in the swan's nest once. That sort of thing. Oh, I don't know. To this day, I think. Oh, look! The Emperor of Nilfgaard. He's come out to show off his new robe. Shit. Roach, can you fucking get here? You know you're not my real roach. You wanna hop on? Or do you want your pink horse? Uh, yeah, well, I'm just gonna go ahead. Meet up with me later. Three little pigs. Hi. Some side missions here. 
know what? They need names. Bloody hell. I can I if I can I have to do these missions here That's now. You really aim to well, concern yourself. Care for a cicorilla? A bit of tobacco? Mm. A dab of fist tech? Oh <sighs> remind me. What tail are you from? Sort flints when I was a lass. But no one bought them, so I branched out. Now I deal in snuffs, puffs, all sorts of fun things. What'll you have, sweeties? Magic beans. Do you have any? If it's not the new name of some kicker I already have, dearies, then no. But maybe you'd like some. Hey, where'd you get that ribbon? That's mine. Is that so? Then why was it lying in the bushes? Find his keepers, sweetheart. Give Sienna the ribbon. Why not, huh? Sugar plum. The only thing I hand out for free is a first hit. To get them to come back for a second, of course. Mm -hmm. For all else, you've got to pay. What if I asked you nicely? Ask me nicely and I might play you for it. A round of cards? Oh, shit. <clears throat> all right. It's quit time. If you lose, and I give win. me the ribbon. Don't get your hopes up. None can best me at Gwent. Well, you haven't met me. <laughs> oh, God. Anyway, have I unlocked any other... Anything? Oh, I got 10. Special card limit? Oh, I was about to say. I have quite a few there. Spoil your tails, monsters? Oh, cool. It's nice that I finally got like more options. I got it quite a. Um, actually. Yeah, we'll do Nilf God. Remember unit cards? Any more? Never mind. It's the same as it always has been. Oh fuck me, game. I always was in my areas. Let's get some sun. Hey, hey. Gotcha, bitch. Fuck you. Well, that's unfair. I didn't mean get rid of one of my cards, you stupid bitch. The reason that person passed, this bitch is winning. Alright. Now I'll pass. Good. Come on. All around. Alright. Come on. Don't have any special cards, you bitch. Fuck. Mine. 
Ah, uh, I screwed myself, I think. Oh dear. Fuck, you're still winning. Uh, this is the only card I got. I've lost this round. Fuck, I lost. We got one card between us. Oh, what? Suck at this game. You lost, friend. So, if you still want that ribbon, you've got to pay up. Wait, I go back a little bit. Ah, uh, you. Well, then I'll do that myself. Oh, yes. Oh, fuck. Only got one. Don't go to the enemy. Wait, it's about to be a freaking draw. Yes, I won. Hell yeah. I really am not. The ribbon's yours. I got lucky. All right. Tell me. What? What you want in return. I'm not doing this out of the kindness of your heart. Don't want anything in return. I... Hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. Alright. Now we go to the piggies. Watch out! Pixies! Ah, uh, bitch. I'm going down. Oh, the three little pigs' homes. Well, you know the story, don't you? Who's afraid of the big bad wolf? On Looks the wolf like today. Big bad's already blown down the houses of straw and sticks. Brick's the only one left. We should look inside. Remember Joss's words? I do not. One bean lies out in the open, guarded by three nobodies. Yeah, it could be it. Stop prodding me and find the beans. Oh, it's not giving me any option. I meant to blow this down. Oh. Wow, I meant to kill them? I don't want to kill them. Pumbotch, they didn't like that. How do you like that silver? Ow. Jesus. Right, 
I never aimed for the one I want. And now I'm dying. Two pigs. In your head for myself. Okay, biggies are down. Bean located. The big bad witcher huffed and puffed, and look, got a bean. It cannot be. What cannot be? You actually have a sense of humor. I do. Stunted a bit, but yeah, it's there. Well, well, aren't you full of surprises? What else are you hiding behind that gruff exterior? Wanna Not find out? Singer. Do a pretty mean rendition of the Maids of Vicovaro, for instance. But some other time, maybe. But here we are chatting away when there's work to do. We must keep looking. I'm gonna loot the pigs first. What's this magic dust? So, do you like it here? No. with magic in general. Illusions, portals, all that. Don't trust any of it. A bow of old-fashioned tastes, eh? I like that. That's right. it, Roach. Fake Roach. Let's go. Doesn't seem to be at home. I adored her. My darling little sis. So adorable. So sweet. Yet when they banished me from the palace. Hello? Can we talk? Shmumbach, my head! Damn it all! I swear that was the last time I drank with Redbeard. Oh, Siana. A bloody long time it's been. You've changed. Whereas you, not at all, big bad wolf. Though it seems you've started running with the wrong crowd. And who should I run with, eh? Thumbelina? One shot and she's under the table. But, 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 what brings you? I've been doing with us. <laughs> Magic yes. beans. Looking for magic beans. Seen any? Mm, I was given one for safekeeping, but... Where is it? Talk! Shh, not so loud. Oh, I can be much louder than this. And resort to other means of persuasion. Uh, right there, the threats. Siana to a T. Listen, I exist to restage a fairy tale. If you want to play at it, I'll be happy to oblige. But it won't be easy. The thing is, little red riding hoods popped her clogs. What? A thousand times they cut my gut open, filled it full of rocks, and drowned me in the river. So once you stopped coming, I decided to repay the little imp for all her loving labor. Good now, what's at the bottom of the well? She and the hunter, which means we can't play, and I'm under no obligation to talk to you, not about beans, nor anything else. So leave me be. Sort of. Mm. So, what now? Don't worry. I'll play with him. No, rather, play him. I just need that little red hood. A piece of apparel, that is. Not the poor girl's corpse. That's a relief. You wish to help me? Here's your chance. Jump in the well and fish it out. Well, chop chop. Yep. You get it done. Jump in the well. Break a leg. Oh, there she is. I only got her in the end.
Hmm. Any luck? Yep. Look what I got. That would never fit you. Give it to me. Of course, I'm not gonna wear it. How do I look? Be good. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Let's go see the big bad wolf. Let me guess. You'll play the granddaughter. Mm-hmm. And you, the hunter. It's all out. You again? I thought that was clear. I will not talk to you if little Red Riding Hood is not with you. You see who's by next to me? Not a problem. Sienna can take her place. What? <sighs> Very well. It's not as if I can forbid you. <laughs> Granddaughter, come closer, sweetie. But, Grandmama, what big eyes you have. The better to see you with, my dear. Granny, what big arms you have. The better to embrace you with, my dear. And, Grandmama, what big teeth you have. Eh? The better to eat you with, my dear. Ah! Thank you on this bitch. Ow. Ow. Too easy. Remember what Joss said about the red bee. A human has it, and he definitely didn't swallow it. Mm-hmm. Gotta open his belly. Bottle caps, fake teeth, a corkscrew. Ah, here it is. Red bean. Cool, cool, cool. Well then, one step closer to our goal. What? Now I find myself wondering if you're just horribly discreet or... If those mutations completely scrubbed away your curiosity, are you really not interested in what happened? In what became of me after they cast me out? I'll listen. Well, since you brought it up, I'd gladly hear the rest. Let's see. They had escorted you out of the duchy. Yes. And the noble knights of Toussaint and I didn't stop until we reached the Ketdu wilderness. They left me there alone, without a copper, in a torn lace dress, right when the frosts were setting in. They assumed something would eat me, or that I'd do everyone a favor and die of hunger. But as always, I failed to live up to expectations. I wandered the woods for a week, went purple from the cold, gnawed the bark from twigs. Finally, I saw a light among the trees, a campsite. They were bandits, bearded, drunk, spattered with blood. I was sure they'd rape me or kill me, or both. Take it neither happened? That's when I learned a robber and a murderer can be a better man than a knight in shining armor. They mm. took me in, we set off for Nazaire, and I did what I could to repay them. I advanced in their ranks rather quickly. Eventually, I became their leader of the whole ragged band. Been through a lot. I have. And throughout this time, my sister was stomping grapes and shagging minstrels on down bedding. She wasn't the one to banish you. And I'm not angry at her for that. I'm angry at her because she forgot about me. Right. We've had our chat. Come. On words.